district finals in Michigan Division 8. If this matchup looks familiar, well, that's because it is. Last year, Whiteford beating White Pigeon in the postseason 38-26. 364 days later, we have a rematch in Ottawa Lake. Slight difference at this time around as both teams are undefeated. Perfect 11-0 records. And as the headline goes, someone's O has got to go. Bobcats managed to slide past the Hudson Tigers thanks to Ryan Ruddy's 19 total tackles in the victory. Coach Todd Teakin has a simple game plan. Match physicality and, well, just do what they do. Win. That's going to be exactly the way it was last year. We're going to have to control the line of scrimmage uh, on both sides of the ball. That they, they are a very physical football team. They just line up and, and go at you. And, and uh, so we're going to have to play very physical in the line of scrimmage. We're going to have to make sure that our uh, linebackers and DBs are reading their keys. And then on the offensive line, we're going to, we're going to have to create holes uh, just like what we did last year. We, we know we're going to get their best from them, and we're going to get the best, the best from everybody that we play. And, um, we, we need to be really locked in this week, and as long as our defensive line does what they did last week and clog up all those holes and up front, they'll leave all the tackles for me, Jake, and Brandon. So they're 11 and 0 as well, and you know they're they're hungry. I mean, their their preseason article said they, that this was their state championship run season, and you know obviously they got a little bit of a revenge factor coming over to play us, and you know and that kind of thing. Uh, they're they're going to be geared up and ready to go. We got to be geared up and ready to go too.